Hello and welcome to the Mark 10 Mission Little Liturgies. I'm so pleased that you are here to spend some special time with Jesus. To remind us that Jesus is alive and with us now. Our candle is burning brightly and we have a green ordinary time cloth on our table. Jesus is about to speak to us in the gospel. But before that, we need to check inside the Mark 10 bag to see if there is anything inside to help us enter into the gospel. So the Mark 10 bag is full of little crosses. How interesting. I wonder how these crosses could be linked to the gospel today. It's time to find out. This is a reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus be in my thoughts, in my words, and in my heart. Jesus said, Whoever is not willing to take up his cross and follow me is not worthy of me. Whoever tries to hold on to his life will give up true life. Whoever gives up his life for me will hold on to true life. Whoever accepts you also accepts me. And whoever accepts me also accepts the one who sent me. Whoever meets a prophet and welcomes him will receive the reward of a prophet. And whoever accepts a man because the man is good will receive the reward of a good man. Whoever helps one of these little ones because they are my followers will truly get his reward. He will get his reward even if he only gave my follower a cup of cold water. How big is love? I think if love was something you could hold on to in your hands, it would be really stretchy. If you keep your love to yourself, it stays small. But if you stretch your love, stretch it around other people, it becomes bigger. If you stretch your love around your family, it might become as big as a house. What if you stretched your love around everyone in your entire school. Wow! How big do you think Jesus' love is? When Jesus died on the cross, he died to save us all and stretched his love around the entire world, over you, me, and everyone on earth. Jesus loves you so much and asks you to stretch your love like his. Jesus invites you to stretch your love not just around your family and friends, but everyone. I wonder if you have ever stretched the muscles in your body. It's good for us to stretch our muscles. It helps them stay strong. But if you stretch them properly, even though it's good for us, it can hurt a bit. It's the same with love. It's hard to stretch our love to everyone. Some people are tricky to love and it feels like it hurts a bit but this helps our love muscle get stronger and stretchier. Saint Teresa, sometimes called Mother Teresa said, if you love until it hurts, there can be no more hurt, just more love. Another thing that makes you stronger is lifting heavy things. In the gospel, Jesus asks you to pick up your cross and follow him. Each time you choose to stretch your love, to be extra kind and caring to others, it's like picking up a little cross. We can show our love in lots of ways. Jesus says, be welcoming and friendly. Smile when you see someone. Even if you just do something simple, like give a thirsty person a drink of water, you are showing your love for Jesus. Each time we pick up our cross and love, we build up the strength in our hearts. Soon our love will be so strong that it can stretch even further than we ever thought it could. Let us pray. 
In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Jesus, thank you that you show me how to love. You went to the cross and stretched your love over the entire world. Your love is amazing, Jesus. Even though it stretches around everyone, it is still tightly wrapped around me, holding me in a beautiful, warm hug. Thank you that I can stretch your love around other people too. Give me the strength to carry my crosses of love every day. I love you, Jesus. Amen. I sign your cross over me A reminder that I am free And I hold your cross in my heart For no longer are we apart Thank you for joining us today on the Mark 10 Mission Little Liturgies. I will be praying for you as you stretch your love just that little bit further this week. Remember that Jesus, who loves you so much, will be right by your side every step of the way. I look forward to seeing you for our next Little Liturgy. Until then, goodbye and God bless. <laughs>